Hello, my name is Mansur Mirza and I would like to discuss with you three abstracts which are practice changing at ASCO. The first one is Duo O. That is a, tri a trial led by and got uh, by our German colleagues and we all participated in that. And that is the first phase three trial in ovarian cancer with immune therapy, which is positive which is a great news for us. That means that we can introduce now immune therapy to our patients in first line and would be able to, uh, patients would be able to benefit from that. Uh, especially, I think the very important message is that in the uh, HRD negative population, you see benefit, which is the real unmet need in first line. So it's great and we are looking forward to get approvals so we can introduce immune therapy to our patients. Second trial I would like to talk about is actually in the early stage cervical cancer, the SHAPE trial, uh, which was an academic trial, but extremely important and practice changing trial. So what happens is if you have up to two centimeters uh, in cervical cancer, uh, we were used to do radical hysterectomy which is quite, uh, which is a very high uh, risk of toxicity, the late uh, toxicity and, and a lot of morbidity. And the trial was randomizing to that versus doing simple hysterectomy with lymph node dissection. And it has shown that it is, it was a non-inferiority trial that it, uh, doing simple hysterectomy is as good as radical hysterectomy. And we are actually going to save so much uh, uh, patients' long-term morbidity, comorbidity, that that is amazing. And I think from tomorrow, we can change our practice uh, knowing the results of this trial. The third trial uh, is the Keynote 8 to 6, also in cervical cancer in the first relapse. We saw the beautiful data of that two years ago in ESMO and published in New England Journal. And very quickly, it became standard of care treatment with platinum plus paclitaxel plus bevacizumab plus minus pembrolizumab. And this year, we saw the final results of overall survival and the updated results of progression-free survival. And all has confirmed the same. Uh, and that means that we can be assured that this has to be completely a stand, new standard of care. Thank you very much.